How do personal injury claims work? It doesn't have to be difficult to shop for insurance for cars, trucks and other vehicles. With the advent of the internet you can do comparison shopping directly from the comfort of your own home. This is a great improvement over the way shopping for insurance for cars was done in the past. Prior to the internet the process was extremely slow and tedious. The first task would be tracking down telephone numbers of insurance agencies. Next would be the slow and laborious task of calling each agency and repeating the information over and over again. No more. Shopping for insurance for cars and trucks is as simple as filling out a form and pressing a button. Before you start your search you may want to think about what type of insurance will work best for you. You two primary choices are comprehensive and third-party insurance for cars. Comprehensive insurance for cars is exactly what it says, comprehensive. This type of policy covers a wide range of damages and even includes situations where you might not be driving such as theft vandalism and weather damage. Third-party insurance coverage is the type that is oftentimes required by law. These policies cover damage to other people's property or automobiles. Pricing for insurance for cars varies widely and is based on a number of factors. A key factor is the type of policy. Comprehensive insurance is going to be the most costly since it is covers so many possible events. Other factors go into the price as well such as your driving record where you live the type of vehicle you drive your age and your gender. All these factors are taken into consideration when an insurance policy is quoted. There are a number of discounts programs available as well. Most of the major insurance companies offer an array of discount programs. Most will offer preferred pricing on insurance for cars if you have an excellent driving record or if you cover multiple vehicles under the policy. You certainly owe it to yourself to investigate these discount programs. Your research on insurance for cars is not complete once you have received your price quotations. You should also do a little research into the company that will be underwriting your policy. While the chances are that the companies that are offering the insurance you are interested in are fine it is possible that they do not provide good customer service or they have a bad track record paying claims. There is a great deal of information available in the public domain that will give you clues to whether or not the company you choose is a good company to purchase insurance for cars from. Your local governmental agency that works with the insurance industry will be able to provide you with information and you should be able to find comments and reviews directly from customers. While the prospect of doing a lot of research in order to buy insurance for cars probably does not sound appealing to you it is well worth the time you set aside for the activity. With just a little investigation you can find an insurance policy that suits your needs as price right and is backed by a good solid company.